Alexa, what's the temperature today? Right now, it's 30 degrees Fahrenheit. Today, expect a high of 55 degrees. Ooh, 30 cars and coffee? I don't know. We're going anyway. Uh, good morning, guys. Uh, this is John. Welcome back to my Sky One YouTube channel. Hope you guys are having a great day. I am just recovering from the flu. I'll get into that in a minute. But let's get the let's get out there and get the car started and head off to Nightdale Cars and Coffee. Be strong. Be strong. guys so uh, a little videos back you saw we went on a I love the way this looks on my car the frost Let's check that out Wait, somebody put some salt on it a um, couple videos back we did a tour van tour and I don't know if you saw that video or not if you haven't I recommend it it's uh, Speedway Motorsports over in Charlotte <coughs> Concord actually can you hear him going? <laughs> anyway, somebody was sneezing in the van and I got the flu. So, <clears throat> I got, I've been over that for a few days now. But, uh, I'm not going to get too close to people. But, yeah. Anyway, heading out to uh, Cars and Coffee in Nightdale. It's going to be a cold one, but should warm up. So, uh. On my sunglasses here. During parking mode, these are gonna fog up on me. I left them in the car at last night. time I start up you hear that I'm gonna probably turn off the audio but I have it play because if somebody bumps my car it lets me know how many instances how many uh, motion instances etc etc um, let me know how you guys leave these things set out if you set them to auto or what you gotta do I gotta turn the radio off copyright Seated, heated, seated. GPS. Here's the sync button I was worried, uh, wondering about. You know, because you can set the left and right separately. But anyway, all right. So it's on auto. Let me take it off of auto and put it on. This is what she's always doing. She's always turning, she's taking the thing off of auto. She's like, I'm hot, I'm cold. <laughs> anyway, oh my gosh, look at the windshield. I think I'm just gonna squirt it. It's gonna make a mess, but. I gotta talk to you. Um, I'm, this, um, this YouTube channel I got here, um, I don't know what's going on. I'm getting really low number of views. I'm not getting any uh, comments. I'm not getting any thumbs up. I really don't understand what uh, what I'm doing wrong. Um, I thought, <clears throat> look how slow this guy's going. I thought, you know, by doing video of, uh, you know, me going to the track, driving around the, Atlanta, um, the Speedway, and going on a tour, visiting the motorsports, I thought that would be something that would be interesting to you guys, but apparently not really low video um, I started out before doing a lot more tech gadgets and amateur radio and things like that um, I don't know maybe I should just go back to that it could be maybe I don't know it's off season but um, if I don't get more thumbs up and more likes more watches I'm, I'm 
going to just probably migrate back over towards technical stuff. So, um, I don't know. thought it was something you guys wanted to see. Is there something about the car? Um, not many people have these wide body challengers in the Scat Pack series. But uh, if there's something you guys wanted to see, let me know. Um, if you do want to keep seeing stuff like car events, because I thought about going to uh, Rockingham Dragway. I was going to go to... Uh, a mud bog competition up here uh, not too far from my house um, there's a lot of things that are car related um, that you know usually are a lot of fun around here but um, if it's not something that's gonna be of interest to you and you'd rather just you know watch watch people do donuts in parking lots then you know maybe maybe this channel is not for you but anyway um, so I'm gonna go to cars and coffee look at this thing pulled out a real nice house here on the corner Put a freaking dollar general in. I like the metal detector. Anyway, um, yeah, so it is what it is. Beautiful day here. It is cold out, 35 degrees. And uh sorry about my ranting, but uh yeah, this is this is it, you know. I was really excited about doing this video for you guys. Um optimize the keywords, the whole nine yards, and uh I got like 35 views, so you know, screw that. If you guys don't want to, don't want to see it. Fine, go ahead and watch somebody else's channel. But uh, yeah, so I'm gonna do this thing here: cars and coffee, and uh, and I'll start going into technical stuff. Somebody's got the throw now. <laughs> I got a spot right up front here, but check out this RT. The RT badges. We got the wider rally stripes on it. But look what he put on the side. <laughs> These little rally stripes I was thinking about putting on. These are wider ones though. It's pretty good though. I like the look of it. I wanna find out whose car this is and find out where who did his stripes. This is uh, my friend Keith's car, the uh, Chevelle. Not sure where all the Thirteen twenty guys are today. This is a human. Wow, look at that! He's still got the sticker on it. Check this out. That's going to be a lot of fun to drive one of these. Yeah, I smell a lot of 
hydrocarbons here. Everybody's getting tuned up here. So it kind of stinks a little bit. It's cold out here, but nice day. But um, I'm going to see if I could just pick out some neat cars here and. Say hi to people I know. Check this car out. Pretty beller. interior wow Mazda that slammed down. Jeez, that's the same year as what mine was. It's bagged. Huh, interesting. My car next to Keith's, and here's mine. I just met this guy. He he's gonna get me the place that put his stripes on. And then I met the guy that's got the red eye over here. He's got the red calipers too. That's pretty nice. He's got the black calipers. Yeah, so he's got the same same package I got. I think. Had a nice long talk with Pope Drago, and uh, we we're talking about <clears throat> how he was racing somebody. He had the Corvette. Uh, he was driving in his uh, M2, and the guy was in a Corvette, and uh, was able to actually beat him at VIR. So um, the faster car isn't always, you know, faster car as in like straight run doesn't necessarily translate into the fastest car on a road course. So kind of interesting to know. Anyway, um, wow, a lot of challengers here. I'm surprised. A lot of red eyes. And the guy next to me, uh, two of the other challengers left. Um, guy had a demon here. It's still in the plastic. Um, I'm not sure if I filmed that or not. But, uh, yeah, still pretty good turnout here. Had a great time. I'm not going to stick around too much longer. It is now 10 a.m. Um, Probably hang out for maybe uh, another half hour or so, and uh, then I'm gonna move on. So uh, yeah, if you guys have any uh, comments or questions, uh, please uh, throw them in there. I'm not getting a whole lot of feedback from you guys. I want to see uh, what your opinion is on this and uh, what it is you want to see. All right. Later. Everybody's got a loud exhaust for me. watching.
heading home. All right, so that was pretty interesting. Um, I started off a little bit negative, thinking nobody liked my videos. I had four people unsolicited come up telling me that they liked my video, so I don't know. I guess people are watching it and they're not thumbing up. Come on, guys, hit the thumbs up. It really helps on my YouTube channel. Um, so anyway, um, I want to show you, uh, I guess, a shopping haul. Some of the things I got at the uh, store over at the um, at uh, the Charlotte Motor Speedway. So I'm going to show you my haul on that. I'm going to call it a haul, but I got a few things. It'd be kind of cool. A couple things I'm going to put on the car and whatnot. Um, chatted with the guy that had the decals, uh, racing stripes. He told me, I guess he got it done at Raleigh Wraps. He says they can put whatever kind you want on there. I think I'm going to... Um, Give them a call and, and uh, maybe have them do it because I definitely like the looks of the rally stripes. Now, his were a little wider than the stock ones, and I thought it looked pretty good. So, anyway, uh, thanks for watching. Um, let's tune in on the uh, <laughs> I just forgot what I was gonna say. So, stay in there, and I'm gonna show you my shopping haul. All right, so here's my haul. It's your logo for the I call it Charlotte Motor Speedway, but it's really Speedway Motorsports Incorporated. They own a bunch of tracks. Um, but before I go into this, I got to tell you, pretty negative on my video. You saw that. Um, I, I do like getting feedback. I, but what I thought was really interesting is at the car meet, um, four people came up to me uh, unsolicited and said that they liked my videos. So it's interesting how things happen that way, right? Uh, I was saying, now listen, I need feedback from you guys, and I got a personal. So I, I don't know what's going on with the counters on YouTube. If you have a YouTube channel and you're just seeing low numbers, it's possible that those numbers just aren't accurate because there's no way I looked at like one of my videos, 35 views, 35, right? And um, does that mean I just met 10% of the people? Because I asked, uh, well, actually more than that, because I asked four of the people today if they saw this video, and they did. They all, all, every one of them saw the video of me on the track. So what's going on? So <clears throat> anyway, just keep plugging, and I don't know. I'm gonna start probably replicating my videos on another source if if, so, if YouTube's playing games. But anyway, um, I want to show you some of the stuff I got here. Um, but first, let me get into this. Add one other thing. Um, Shout out to Jonathan, my neighbor. The yellow um, <laughs> TTO that I said that I can hear it start from my from my kitchen. Yeah, I got to meet him. Really nice guy. Jonathan, good to meet you. And um, check out another friend uh, that I was chatting with for a while, Poke Drago. Check out his channel. I mean, he, he's got a whole different... Uh, he, he looks at some really nice cars, uh, supercars, so... And he's got something. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna tell you what it is, but he's got something new going to his channel too. Now, when I went, and you're gonna see this on my next video where I do the tour of uh, um, Hendrick Motorsports. Um, but while I was in there, I met this guy, and he started this uh, foundation. Okay. So apparently. Um, his mom died from this. This is some sort of rare disease, uh, melioma, and it's a uh, it's a form of cancer. It's it's it it's a bone marrow attack, and so it's kind of like leukemia, I guess. Now my wife's dad died from leukemia, and so he's that's his mom, Wilma McGrant. And he's trying to do an awareness thing here. So I want to just give you a shout out. He's got this website. Milioma. M-Y. I hope you guys can see that. Um, now I don't know a whole lot about this. But. Um, so he talks about this in, in this. In this letter but I think you guys should just check out this website okay hilioma.org and see if there's any way you can help out um, really super guy and, and I'm just 
I just feel it's so awful when you're when your parents or friends or whatever died. I, I, I gotta give a shout out to another YouTuber that we watch. We really enjoy. Uh, their name is uh, Sean and Steph. I don't know if you watch them. Um, they they do a lot of cruise videos where they go on a cruise and they go to different places. Some of it's really corny, but it's there's so much fun to watch. And uh, Sean got rushed to the hospital, and he's in the hospital now for um, what cancer does he have? He got stage four pancreatic cancer. So you don't get any symptoms. Just suddenly, oh, I don't feel good. You go to the doctor and it's like you got stage four cancer. I mean, oh my God. Um, so there's a lot to this couple. Um, you really need to check out Sean, S-E-A-N, and Steph, S-T-E-F, like Stephanie. Um, God, I'm praying for them as well. It's just so much going on. Anyway, uh, so let's get into my haul here. Got a big bag here. And uh, matter of fact, let me switch shirts. Got all the labels still on there. <clears throat> Coca-Cola 600. Now, it's called the World 600 Race. Um, Coca-Cola typically sponsors it. I don't know if they're going to sponsor it for this next year. But I got this shirt. And I got this one. And look, when you get them... You know, out of date. Do the price five bucks. So um, yeah, pretty nice. So I'm pretty stoked. Got the new shirt and uh, and I got the older shirt, but I don't care. Picked up some of these. So I got these window decals. I'm gonna put these on my side windows that right above Sky One. Got a little fridge magnet. And I got this pen, so 60th anniversary. And this has got two, two spots, so it doesn't turn on you. So that's pretty nice. I like them with the magnets, but it's pretty cool. Pretty cool pen indeed. And uh, I just couldn't resist this cap. God, is a really nice hat. I don't normally wear baseball hats, but I really like that one. Embroidered 60th anniversary. Anyway, so that's what I got. Um, this is my. This is the cage for my GoPro. I was wondering where that was. So anyway, um, hope you enjoyed it, and uh, please give me a thumbs up, uh, like, subscribe, comment. Let me know what you guys want to see. Uh, just give me some kind of kind of feedback that you guys are out there and alive. All right, so uh, everybody have a great day. Thanks for watching. Later. Bye.